LB Shadow Lady and Smallish Beans. Could that be a more perfect pair? Mm, no, I didn't think so. Here are eight moments where Lizzie and Joel prove they are straight up Minecraft's craziest celebrity couple goals. <laughs> <laughs> I can see it's touching. Yes, your <laughs> toe looks like an octopus. <laughs> While Lizzie and Joel spent tons of time playing Minecraft together, they like to shake up their content from time to time and try something new. Sometimes that involves real life challenges and games. Other times they'll go for something a little bit out of left field. In this particular YouTube live stream back in the Christmas season of 2017, Joel and Lizzie tried baking a cake with each other, preparing the actual cake in the first part of the stream and coming back after around an hour to decorate it. Just look at these two cooking together. I literally could watch them do this all day. Anyways, after finishing the cake after about 45 minutes of preparation, Joel and Lizzie popped their cakes into the oven and ended the first stream. Everything was fine and dandy until that point. But things took a turn for the crazy. When Lizzie, while still awaiting the cake to finish baking, accidentally restarted the live stream without realizing it for the next two minutes. LD Shadow Lady fans watched in awe as Lizzie stood around the kitchen watching the earlier part of the stream on her phone. But Lizzie's reaction when she finally realized she was streaming, <laughs> absolutely priceless. After closing out the stream and coming back for what should have been part two, but it was now part three, Joel messed around with Lizzie, stating that the fans saw Lizzie checking herself out on her phone camera, which she denied entirely. They went on to finish decorating their cake, and the wholesomeness then continued. You never really know what you're getting yourself into when you open up fanfiction about pretty much anything and everything. But what happens when you read fanfiction that was written by one of your own fans starring, well, you? Thankfully, Lizzie and Joel were brave enough to do exactly that. Joel found one fanfiction that was just crazy enough that he and Lizzie decided to read it out loud to the fans in the YouTube video reacting to fanfiction with Elvis Shadow Lady, entitled Jizzy, the story so far. This Wattpad fanfiction is over 50 chapters and the first few chapters follow Smallish Beans as the cool kid in high school as he falls in love with his math tutor and classmate Lizzie. But because this is a fanfiction, you know there has to be drama. Joel of course has a girlfriend named Mackenzie, who he dumps after the school bully Luke treats Lizzie like garbage and Mackenzie doesn't defend her. Then there's Kevin, Lizzie's creepy ex who kidnaps Lizzie twice throughout the story. But of course, Joel swoops in to save the day and rescues Lizzie from Kevin's home. There's a lot more to it, but you get the idea. Lizzie and Joel's first fanfiction video was so well received that it became came an entire series on the channel as they continued acting out the story for their fans. Remember though, the author of the fanfic was like nine at the time of writing the story. So just take all of those strange quirks of the story with a grain of salt. Lizzie and Joel loved acting it out though, so it was all in good fun. We all know that Smallish Beans can be a little, uh, how do you say, right, um, chaotic from time to time. But fun fact, Lizzie's also got a devious side to her that comes out to play every once in a while. For example, in the nether on the Empire's SMP season two server, Lizzie he broke Joel's nether portal right as he made his way back to the land of Stratos. Playing the innocent card, Lizzie begged for Joel's help because by breaking the portal, she had apparently trapped herself in the nether without any flint and steel. Going back through the portal to help his wife, Joel spawned a new portal nearby the broken one to help her escape. But instead of going back through the portal Joel created for her, Lizzie lit up the old portal frame, spawning another portal on the ground below the sky city. Joel, completely exhausted with Lizzie screwing up his portal system, went to break the portal only for Lizzie to keep replacing the obsidian blocks on the frame. Just to troll Joel even more. <laughs> Never change your chaotic ways, Lizzie. Never change. As I stated before, Joel and Lizzie like to change content up from time to time. And one of the ways they have done that in the past is through fun challenges. Well, during the highly popular Try Not To Laugh challenge back during 2016, Lizzie and Joel had to keep water in their mouths while watching funny videos. They also would spit water at each other and all over the place. Let's just say things didn't go well for them. Joel was the first to break with a video of an opera singing shrew spewing water all over Lizzie. Lizzie and Joel went on to react to old videos of Joel, Lizzie and even the Orion sound in their infant years on YouTube completely breaking them and causing them to spew even more water on each other. In the end, Joel's pants were completely soaked. The real winners of that challenge were the fans who got to watch the whole thing, let's be real. After starting his Jeremyism cult, oh, I, I'm, I mean religion, on the X life server, Joel was struggling to find players who were willing to join. So naturally, he did what any reasonable person would do. He tried to trick Ellie Shadow Lady into completing the initiation ritual. But Lizzie is not so easily fooled and she immediately realized what Joel was trying to do. So she made it clear that she was not interested in joining Joel's cult. It's just good luck again, real good luck. Please. I don't want good luck. You do, okay, well it's also, 
you get given a diamond in return if it happens, apparently. I don't want to do this. No. Lizzie, what are you doing? Lizzie, I don't no. want to do this. Please, please, please join my cult. Religion, cult, cult, religion, please join. Please join, please. I just throw it into the fire, please. I need members. I've got no members, Lizzie. It's just me. I'm not joining a cult. It's not a cult. That's a, no. I tried, I tried. So with determination to get Lizzie to join, Joel once again did what any reasonable person would do. He created an entire story about how Lizzie was secretly the founder of Jeremyism because she was the original caretaker of Donkey Jeremy. He then built a massive statue in honor of Saint Lizzie, complete with a leashed Donkey Jeremy. After showing the statue to his wife, Lizzie affirmed that she definitely wasn't the founder of Jeremyism. But Joel still continued to spread the good news around the server. At the end of the X-Life series, Joel admits that the entire cult of Jeremyism was just a part of his plot to create more chaos on the server. So it's pretty clear Joel was just trying to, you know, prank Lizzie. But I can't help but wonder if it just might be true. Elder Shadow Lady might be super nice and super sweet, but she just can't help herself when given the opportunity to mess around with Joel. One running gag is that Lizzie has jump scared smallish beans several times on his channel, both in real life and in Minecraft. There's a time when Lizzie jump scared Joel in game while mining clay on an Empire Season 1 livestream. Not once, but twice. Then in the same livestream, Lizzie wanted Joel to know that she was just as scary in the real world, so she scared him again. This time with Joel begging her to stop. Finally, an entirely different blindfolded building challenge video. Lizzie managed to sneak behind Joel and scare the living daylights out of him. That's right, in terms of scaring, it's Lizzie 4, Joel 0. Uber fans of Elder Shadow Lady might recognize that Lizzie has a sister named Maddie, who has made cameos on LD Shadow Lady's YouTube and Twitch channels, such as in Lizzie's best friend versus boyfriend challenge, or even in some of Lizzie's Minecraft Twitch streams, known as Stardew Maddie on Twitch and Micro Glitching on YouTube. Maddie would stream with her sister from time to time before her channel went on to an indefinite hiatus. But back during the days, she would stream Among Us with Lizzie, Joel, and their Minecraft gang. There was one day where Joel would slip up big time. After thinking he had sent Eldie Shadow Lady a Twitch subscription stating that he was a huge fan of her and that he would love to marry her someday, Joel was shocked to find out that he had accidentally sent the Twitch subscription to Stardew Maddie. Everybody had a good laugh about the whole thing, including Lizzie. You know, of course, everyone knew it was an accident. <laughs> Still, that's gonna sting Joel. That proposal might have been an accident, but this one certainly wasn't. You see, in need of a powerful queen to match his oversized ego, the great Mandalorian King Joel of Empire Season 1 thought it would be a good idea to propose to Lizzie the Ocean Queen. After setting up a scaffolding contraption that, when broken, would rain down clay from the sky in the shape of a blue ring, Joel met up with Lizzie and proposed to her for the second time in his life, just this time in Minecraft. While she was confused at first, Lizzie of course agreed to marry him. What made this super wholesome was mostly the fact that Smallish Beans really isn't much of a role player within the Empire's SMP, but he went entirely out of his way to propose to Lizzie within Minecraft, simply because he loved her that much and wanted to help his wife tell the Empire's SMP story. But what makes this whole even more wholesome was the fact that Joel even went on to provide his singing voice in the musical number Real Love during the Empire's SMP musical that recreates the whole moment. It just shows you how committed he is to Lizzie. 